Okay, hi everybody. So, sorry if you can hear the TV in the background. I tried to turn it down, but every time I turn it down, somebody comes in and turns it back up. So, I don't know why, because everyone else is asleep, and just whenever I turn down the TV, they come out and turn it up. So I don't know what's going on and why they're doing that, but anyways, we'll be playing some more spooktacular games. It's 10.21pm right now. Uh, I already recorded a couple spooky games today, but I decided, hey, why not give myself nightmares? <laughs> um, so we're going to play Ask the Spirits. Um, since my Ouija board in real life doesn't work, or maybe the spirit world will work. <laughs> I don't know what the best one is. So, I'm actually going to mute the site, um, unless it has a option to turn down the volume because I realized in my last video the gameplay was super loud. So the intro is just us walking in a cemetery. So let's wait till it decides to let us go across. Cool, cool. Your name. Aurora. Date of birth. 19... Oh, your birth. Well, good thing I read that right. <sighs> okay. I don't need to do that. Ask the board. Is anybody there? Is anybody there? Is any- <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Enter. <laughs> I think it's broken. Hello? <laughs> Hang on, let me turn the sound on. Um, I don't know how you turn it on. Are you there? <laughs> Alright, um, I think we have an issue with the spirits in this game. Don't, don't even want to talk to me. <laughs> Look, no matter what I do. What is your name? <laughs> oh, wow. Um, so I think I'm gonna switch games. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so um, I dropped my mic and broke the cord, so I had to fix it before I could continue recording. Anyways, this is a game called Exit. People say it's easy, as you can see. Easy game with progressive complexity. We all know that's not going to work for me. So, we gotta wait till it loads. I didn't see that it was 3D. It takes forever for 3D to load for me. <laughs> Alright, it's still loading. <laughs> I'm probably going to edit this part out. Or I won't. It all depends on if I want to edit or not. <laughs> oh my god. That is so loud. What is going on? Alright. Exit. How do I oh this escape? Okay. Help. <laughs> Stuck up the line. 
I keep freezing on my screen, that's why I keep saying stuff. Oh, I'm so dumb. That was so dumb of me, I should have noticed since I put my head in that flame thing. <sighs> Let me rooftop um underground. Okay, so I just played the game. I did not like the controls at all. You could only use your mouse or your keyboard keys, um, not WASD, to move what action you wanted, then you had to click, and it was super uncomfortable. Um, so we're playing a game called Plant Lover. <laughs> I like plants. We're waiting for it to load, but don't you fret, it will load soon. My cat is now behind you, so be prepared for my cat to harass us. Made with Unity. Yep. Indeed. Okay. Is there a noise? Oh yeah, there is. Oh my god, that was so loud. Oh. Alright. 
am I supposed to let it get up there? <laughs> and we let it go up there and see what happens. What the? Okay, so we'll be playing Ghostscape today. This game is pretty loud, so I'm gonna mute it. Um, we're waiting for it to load. Warning, this game c contains scary, cool way to spell scary, moments, and adult themes. Does it? Does it really? Crowbar. A massive gargoyle. I'll take a picture. Like, you can't take a picture of it? That's dumb. Alright, let me in. The door is slammed shut. The front door is slammed shut and it seems to be locked. There must be a key in the house somewhere. Take a look around, take some photographs, try to figure out what happened here. Mm. Nah. I'm good. Very strange photo. <gasps> a ghost. <laughs> Poltergeist activity. Looks like a diary page. I'll read the diary pages later. My cat is knocking my computer off because he decided to lay right behind it. Some more photos. Um, I'm not too sure what what to do. <laughs> I played this when I was very, very little, and this scared me so bad. Um. Click to enter. I'm just holding the camera. <laughs> Looks like a diary page. Another orb. This game is too spooky. Oh, oh, can I take a picture of that? <gasps> Come and join us. No, I'm good. Thanks for the offer. Look. Hello. Oh, you can't take a picture of that? Oh, we missed the ghost. Oh well. That would be something you want to take a picture of. The ghost and the blood. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. What is that? A scrap of paper. Why would you even come in this house? Can I move that chip? No? Uh, downstairs. In the kitchen. In the kitchen. Lounge. That was the kitchen. Take a picture. Take a picture of the orb. Take a picture of the picture. Oh, some more poltergeist activity. So spooky. Book on the floor. <laughs> Another picture. Leave us alone. Okay, I will try. Let's see. Oh, look, there's the puzzle thing. So let's go back upstairs and go in here. And it's that thing. I down up. Wait. Okay, so six. Two, down up I said yeah nine one no six two nine four oh it's a cross uh -huh. six two nine four oh I thought you had to click it one at a time um where'd my key go oh the door slammed shut <gasps> oh that's bad I found a red candle. Oh, there's the key up there. Oh, and I found a key. Use bathroom key to get out. Okay. <laughs> this is seller. Use seller key. Yep. We just do that. Oh. Looking around. Oh, so knife, infinity, Aquaman. Or tried it, I meant, and I. Knife, 7, infinity, 8, Aquaman, 3, 2. 7, 8, 3, 2. 7, 8, 3, 2. What key was that? Oh, bedroom key. This would have been a good spot for a spook, tech, or spook. Oh, a diary page. Another orb. As you can see, I'm very entertained. <gasps> the remains of somebody. Oh, that sucks. I hate it when I find the remains of a human. Upstairs. 
Let's go to the bedroom. This bedroom? Bedroom? Bedroom. Nice of them to color coordinate the thing. Oh, that <laughs> made me jump. <laughs> Be gone, demon. Alright, so it's arrow, slender man, slender man, the thing. Arrow, slender man, slender man, thing. Arrow, one, zero, zero. What was thing? Oh, yeah, thing. Six. One, zero, zero, six. I think. One, zero, zero. Yep. A pantry key. I found an amulet. The pantry's in the kitchen. <sighs> I'm having a bowl. A bowl. My cat was about to scratch me. That's pretty rude. I was doing nothing to them. As you can see, I have a real problem with my cats being jerks to me. Oh, I missed it. Oh, my god, and then my cat jumped on my chair right as I leaned back, and I almost knocked him down. Sorry, kitty kitty. Another thing, and a diary page. Alright. Cool. Was that everything I needed? So let's read the diary pages real quick. Where's- oh, we need one more. That first one is, we just moved- oh, 1973. Uh, we just moved into our lovely new- house and it's great. Can't wait to start working on it with Jason. Oh my god, there's so much to read. Alright, so bad stuff happens. I'll read the last one. I can't even read that. There's something blah blah blah, blah in the cellar. <laughs> I didn't want to read it, as you can plainly tell. How do I get up there? I need to use a ladder to get to the attic. Where's the ladder? Hey, you know where the ladder is? Oh. Uh, now we've got to sit here for a second. In hopes that pops back up. Hello? We. Oh wait, let's go there. Maybe I'll trigger it. My cat's meowing because they jumped onto the fridge. <laughs> Just jump down. Oh, uh, well, they jumped higher. Hello? Why are you here? Because I want to be. What are you going to do about it, ghost? That would have been great if a jump scare happened right then. Um, where's the ladder? Did I go past it? I definitely did. Not there. There it is. Thank you, thank you, going upstairs, put the ladder, we're missing something, oh, um, that thing, that thing, that thing, that thing, seven, three, I don't remember what it was, oh yeah, seven, three, eight, five, maybe? Seven, three, eight, five. Mm, read it wrong. Okay, so it's cross, uh, trident, infinity, star. Cross, oh, nine, trident, three, infinity, eight, star, five. So nine, three, eight, five? Yeah. Nine. I was close. Three. Eight. <laughs> but I was very close. That was impressive. What do I do now? Click here to light the red candles. Oh wait, there's something I need to get a picture of up here. Uh, uh. <laughs> Use front door key. Okay. Woman murders husband in cold blood, then hangs herself. Sightings of weird lights in the area. Halloween is here. Wow. Well, 10 out of 10 gameplay, me. <laughs> uh, good game, good game. Oops, okay, so I just played a different game. Oh, that's loud. And I did not like it, so <laughs> we're not going to play that. Now we're going to play I Can't Escape. 
Um, we're gonna use arrow keys. Oh, I thought you could click it. I like turning it as bright. Kind of cool. It auto puts you in um, full screen. Look at us go. <laughs> running, running. Can I go in there? Oh, I can. Cool. Can't escape. Turn around, my dude. Let me in. <laughs> oh, I fell down. Owie, I fell down. Oh, okay, so if I just step on the black dots there, I'll show you. You can see it. I fall. So, I know I'm trying to escape, but, like, is it even possible? Because, look, there's a ladder right there, but there's a little hole, so... You just fall. Oh, look, there's a ladder there. Let's go down. Oh, you can't. <laughs> Turn around. Oh, dead end. I crashed into the wall. Cool, cool. Oops. <laughs> the controls to me are a tiny bit weird, but it's a really fun game. I've played it before. I'm not sure if there's an actual ending or not. If there is, I've never beat the game, but is that a surprise at this point? Have I ever beat any game? And the answer to that is I've beaten GTA, so... You know, the hardest game in the world to beat. <laughs> um, I think, honestly, that's the only... Well, other than, like, Pokemon and Super Mario Brothers, I think GTA is the only game that I've ever beat. <laughs> that's kind of sad, but... I like GTA a lot. I still play it, like, every day, basically. GTA 5, of course. I like GTA 4 a lot, but, oh, I fell again, um, but I don't have it. <laughs> it's just getting darker and darker. Oh, no, did you see that? Um, I saw that. Uh, just fall down. I knew that was going to happen, so there was no point in even bothering. Turn around. Turn around, bright eyes. Every now and then I get really scared. Oh, I picked up a key. Oh, dang it. Hey. Oh, well, hey, handsome. Hey, handsome eye, you looking good. I'm just falling deeper and deeper in here. I give up at this point. Does it, those kill me? Oh. Did it knock me down or did I fall down? <sighs> I have a feeling. Hey, eyeball. That's just gonna get worse. Oh, I ran out of keys, I think. Home. Are you kidding? So, I've never fallen this far before. <laughs> I normally give up. So, I'm a little tiny bit nervous. It's almost midnight-ish. It's 11.09, so... And I lay down at midnight generally, or else I stay up all night. Now I'm really scared. <laughs> I was actually thinking about watching a horror movie tonight. Not really sure what one, though. Um, I love horror movies. <laughs> I've seen, like, over a thousand. Oh, are you joking me? In my short lifespan. But I love horror movies. Any sort of horror movie. I'm not a huge fan of paranormal ones or zombie ones because that's been played to uh, dead. Uh death I meant but uh, good joke either way even though the delivery was bad um but I love ones with like serial killers in it not like real serial killers not oh <laughs> not a huge fan of those ones but I like like um 
like um, Friday the 13th and Halloween. I love Texas Chainsaw Massacre. That movie I saw when I was young, young, like 11 ish, because it came on randomly one night. Scarred me a little bit. <laughs> Another hole, huh? Just go over there, fall in the hole. Oh, there's no hole. I can't believe it. Um, but yeah, that movie. That movie and The Ring, um, no, the, yeah, The Ring. I saw The Ring when I was four. My dad let me watch it when I was at his house for the weekend. That movie scarred me, like, for real scarred me. Um, I'm not scared of it now. And, sorry I'm rambling, by the way, I'm getting a little spooked. But, um, when I first saw it, since I was four, thanks, Dad. <laughs> um, oh. I was scared to, no, it was the grudge, are you, mm, you idiot, <laughs> it was the grudge, because I remember, because I was scared to take showers or baths, because I thought, like, the hand in the grudge, how it came out of her hair when she was showering, um, I thought that would happen to me, <laughs> but the ring I saw, too, when I was about the same age, whew, <sighs> that scarred me, I was just scared of TVs. <laughs> For a long time, I didn't sleep with a TV in my room, or a TV on when I was trying to sleep, because um, I saw the ring. But then I was thinking, why are you scared about the TV? You didn't, mm, you idiot, you didn't watch the tape, so you know, you'll be fine. You didn't get the call that said seven days, you watched the tape because it was on the video, but, you know, logic isn't. A little kid's strong suit. <laughs> Oops, sorry, I was staring at my cat for a second and then I just crashed. What is going on? Well, oh, we're screwed. Uh oh. <laughs> we'll spin until death. Are we blacking out? Well, that was. Uh, like five minutes of me rambling about the ring. Okay, so I read you can't really escape. <laughs> so we're gonna play a nice little relaxing game to end off the night. Um, I promise I'm gonna stop rambling about horror movies, but I really like them. So now we're just waiting for this to load. Oh, I think we can unmute this one. What just happened? Oh, it was unmuted. Oh, Jesus. Never mind about that. Let's do a nice stylish look. Stylish shave. Okay, so you want snow hair? Gotcha. I can get you on that. No? Yeah, just no hair. Brush off his eyebrows. Gotta keep them eyebrows looking, looking good for the ladies. Careful. Oh, I snipped, <laughs> snipped a little bit. A little. Oh, wow. Well, good thing I did that. Cut that little piece off. Cut that. Alright, let's see how we did. 100%. Yeah, yeah. Is this George R.R. R. Martin? Wow, such an honor. So, you want no beard and no mustache? Can do. Can do that for you, my dude. Oh, there's just a smidget right there. Oh, I cut off his, um, razor, razor burns. Um, what are those called? Sideburns. Razor burns. Maybe I did it right. Oh, I don't know. Finish. 100%. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he wants the mohawk look, like I'll be able to do that. Mohawk. With his eyebrows. Let's brush off right there. Be very careful. <laughs> He's gonna look real bad when we're done. <laughs> yep. Alright. Oh, just no beard? Okay. Can do that 
for you today. I'm not very good, but I will try my best for you. Oh, you look very good, sir. Um, do you work in the city? Oh, I can't really talk that much. You're shaving my face. That's how he sounds. Oh, sorry, sir. Well, I kind of messed up your beard or your mustache. Sorry. Well, he's still happy. <sighs> so just none of that stuff. Okay. Can do. Cover your mouth. <laughs> That's how you shave people. You cover their mouth with shaving cream. Razor. Imagine if you could give them razor burns. <laughs> Alright, finish. 94. Pretty good. Wow, we did really bad. So, I just wanna... I wanna just make them look good. Let's get rid of those. Um, now, we're going to shave there. Brush off the extra. Oh, that little spot can stay. That's fine. We're going to shave all over there except for the middle bit. <laughs> Laughing at my own masterpiece. Finish. <laughs> he looks good. Okay, you. I feel like we can do something really good for you. So what if we do no facial hair whatsoever and just keep the hair on your head, with the exception of a little bit off the side. Yeah, that's even. Well, that little. Oh, uh, let's cream that thing up. You think you just get up and walk away? Okay. So, oh, dang it. Oops, wrong button. Click. Click. Okay, now let's brush. Oh yeah, that's good looking. What? That was a hundred. Okay. What can we do with him? Let's do the opposite of what he wants us to do. So we'll get rid of his hair and his eyebrows. Oh, the birds are pissed about something probably a demon I contacted. Alright, let's brush. See that masterpiece? Oh, yeah. <laughs> His glasses broke. Oh, well, you're a handsome gentleman. How would you look if we just shaved right down the middle of your face? Oops. I think that looks good. I would date him. Oh, sorry. Brush your eyes. Oops. Don't look at me. Um, you know, you're never gonna get a job if you look like that. So, I'll just help you out. We all know the economy is tough enough without you messing it up with that rad hair you have. And the eyebrows. Well, you can keep that half of the eyebrow. <laughs> okay. Well, we, we did good, I think. Okay, so that game inspired me to play just, just one more quick game. Oh, hang on. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> um, just one more quick game of Rapunzel Glittery Makeover. Obviously, she's a princess, so we have to make her look as fabulous as possible. I switched sites just for this game. Let me close the little tab. But yeah, here we go. Play. I muted this site, too, because I have a feeling the music is horrendous. <laughs> Oops. Whoops, daisies. Play. Rapunzel Glittery Makeover. I like the ones... Oh, this is laggy. <laughs> I like it when they have weird backstories. Well, you know we gotta make her eyebrows blue. Contacts. Um, she looks kinda like a demon with black eyes, so that's good. Um, what does she look like? Oh, that looks 
kind of normal. Well, the blush isn't gonna do much for her. Let's see, what do you look like with green eyeliner? Mm, can you? Not brown. Let's try. Let's try purple. Huh. I think green looks best. Oh, I guess let's try red. Oops. Because that kind of looks strange. Yeah, that, that's fine. And of course we're going to do <laughs> the brightest colors that we can. Oh, I don't have to click and hold. That looks good. And what is the clumpiest looking eyelashes we can find? Not those ones. Not those ones. No, no. No, no. Oh! Stop! Sorry, my dog was being silly. I'll edit that out. Oh, look at that. <laughs> and of course the orange lipstick. Oh yeah. Next. Oh, she's gonna be fighting off the men with both hands. Ooh. Let's see. My dog is having some issues, if you can't tell. Well, let's put her dress on first. Mm. <laughs> oh, that goes well with her eyeshadow. Okay, let's check out the shirts. My dog is staring at the wall and licking it, so... That's a list. Oh, and then he just sneezed. Poor boy. He's old. So I just let him do what he wants. <laughs> but these don't seem like what a princess would wear to me. Let's give her... <laughs> let's give her that, but with a top that does not match. Like that. And <laughs> the Elsa crown with a sparkly bag and some jewels and... Oh yeah. Oh, I forgot to fix her hair. Or her. Yeah, her hair. Oh well. Well, yeah. There's our gorgeous model. <laughs> well, sorry about that. My not very bright dogs barked at me saying uh, whatever I just said. <laughs> so, anyways, this is Beauty Influencer Makeup Tips. Um, no music because I know it's going to be awful. Hello, guys. It's me, Nikki. Hello. So, Nikki Tutorials. Follow my makeup art. Right, Slow down! Color corrector. Yeah, I know. I don't care. I just want to make you look beautiful, girl. With the beauty blender, huh? What is going- I can't get it on the other one! There we go. Rub it in! Okay. Next is a pore filling primer to get the flawless base. Okay. The pore primer. <sighs> Funny. Next, foundation to hide imperfections. Use small amount, no cakiness. Keep your sponge moist so it blends out everything. The damn little water emoji made me laugh. Hmm. That looks a little weird. Oh, she blended in. Red lips are gross, so use lip balm to hydrate your lips. Yeah. Of course. Great tip. Last step, setting powder fix everything, makeup, blah blah blah. <laughs> As you can see, I'm very excited. Are you kidding? I'm not gonna watch an ad for you. There's no ad playing. Okay, so there's an ad. Not cool. I love plump matte lips. I want to give her purple lips, eyeshadow. Blend away. Swatch your favorite colors. Yes, queen. Oh, that is bad. Oh, that green was kind of hideous. <laughs> yeah. Use highlight for that glazed donut. Wait, can't we slow down, girl? I can't read that fast. If this is how fast beauty 
guru's talk that would explain why I don't watch him. Yeah, that looks good. Bold insta baddy brows. Is that how they talk? Yuck. <laughs> Yikers. <laughs> Those look good. Don't wear contact lenses if your eyes are sensitive. Yeah, no shit. Huh? Um, what will make her look like a demon? Black eyes. <laughs> False lashes are a must for me. Not for me. I don't know how to put them on. Um, there we go. That looks good. I'm spraying her face. Yeah, she looks real good. How much do I spray on her? <laughs> Finished with a little setting spray, but you did three sprays. Outfit. Wow. I love the- no, I'm not gonna try. No. Barbie. Did- I don't like chokers. They look weird to me. I'll choke you. Um. <laughs> there. Now she looks kind of like, um, I'm not gonna say. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna play one more game. I promise this will be the last game. Okay, so I saw this game that <laughs> interested me. So this is Elsa makeup removal game. I don't know why it interested me, I just really wanted to play it. <laughs> Elsa makeup removal game. Let's get those lashes off, girl. Get those lashes. Next. Oh, am I gonna have to click next for everything? Let's wipe your makeup off your eyelids. Next. Q-tips with more makeup remover. I'm assuming, at least, that's makeup remover. Rubbing your bags under your eyes or something. Rub, rub, rub. Hello. Oh, there we go. Lipstick. Oh, nope. I guess they can use, like, a cloth for that. Next. Oh, how did I know? Next. <laughs> moisturize, moisturize. Very important to always moisturize. It's probably the most important thing you can do to your face, especially if you have dry skin. Then spray your face with water, soap. I don't know what that is. Oh, I guess that was face wash. Well, important to wash your face too, but I still stand by the moisturizing statement I just made. Get your chin, get your forehead. Oh, her face is real red now. Must have been some hot, hot water. Oh my god, I just had a heart attack. <laughs> Something moved and scared me. What is this? Oh, more face wash or something. Next. Um. Oh. Rubbing some stuff on your face. Is this moisturizer now? Um. Hello? Oh. Next. Yep, I think that was moisturizer. Under eye cream. Under eye cream next something oh lip serum serum sounds like syrup <laughs> i don't know why i said that let your hair down girl oh yeah girl you're looking fine today next let's see what what would elsa wear as pajamas pajamas i feel like she'd wear Something like that more so than something short. Like short related, not short. I don't think those are inappropriate. <laughs> maybe something like that. And she'd sleep with maybe an Olaf doll. I know that's probably supposed to be Anna, but I think she would sleep with Olaf because wasn't that like their imaginary friend or something? I don't remember the story about it. Anyways, <laughs> let's look at Elsa. Well, that's the last game. Um, I hope you enjoyed this gameplay. I know I didn't get as spooked, um, but yeah, I got really scared that I'd have nightmares, so 
I hope you enjoyed. If you did, that's good. <laughs> I'll see you all when I make another video. Goodbye.